all right so here we go for the second part got the angle gear off uh, so basically a signal in line this thing gets loose seems like mine is tight so I'm happy about that um, this thing a lot of corroded gunk in there I gotta clean that completely out before I put it back together I'm gonna have it shiny um, it wasn't bad bolt on top wasn't too bad um, you just need an uh, angle to uh, get it off like get a wrench with an angle on it that be able to bend this guy right here second one to the top you need a short wrench very short wrench and just pull out of force on it these guys are easy uh, tap this with a hammer or a bar sometimes he gets stuck in there mine was like kind of stuck had to wiggle him out and then uh should slide fairly easy out um, this is where the bolts went into this is where the sleeve I'm going to be replacing I'll show you the uh, sleeve soon and then that's where the dry shaft goes and this is where the axle go so I'm gonna clean all that up let's try to see if I got that seal make sure I have it that thing is like you can see the, the little metal in there and I'm gonna degrease this because I had to wash my hands this thing was a mess uh, still doing good it took me like 20 30 minutes or less basically I wish I had this I'm gonna change the turbo because this thing focus is going on. So that is what I'm gonna replace. Go to AutoZone. There's a tool that actually yanks this thing out. I'm gonna try to see if I can record it and yank it out at the same time when I get the tool. AutoZone not too far. The turbo, like I said, I replaced the center part. And then I did not even take this off, so it was good. Didn't even have to replace the seals, but I would not recommend it because it get a lot of cramps in your hands and arms. It's ridiculous. I'm wondering actually, see if this thing is stripped. Actually, it is. It's like worn down. Yeah. I wonder if you can see it. It's probably too dark. Maybe you get a flashlight. So there's some seals in there I gotta replace around it. So, alright, I'll be back. 